Hello and welcome to Nikolai's Genetics Lessons and today I have prepared another probability problem for you and here's a problem in a class there are 15 boys and 10 girls three students are selected at random the probability that one girl and two boys are selected is and you have to choose the correct answer as usual I recommend you to pause the video here try to solve this problem on your own first and when you'll be ready you can run video again and you can compare your answer with my answer and explanation Right away, I want to give you an answer. It is here. For those of you who know how to solve this type of problems using uh, formulas such as uh, uh, combinations and permutations. But for those of you who do not understand what we see here and how we got this answer, I have a better explanation for you that doesn't require extensive knowledge of um, subject but we are going to use common sense and logic instead so uh, imagine that we have to choose three people out of a group of uh, 25 people 15 boys and 10 girls so three places place number one place number two and place number three first person we choose can be whether a boy or a girl so two variants are possible Second person we choose also can be boy or girl, so two variants. And third person we choose also can be whether a boy or a girl. So if we multiply all these probabilities, um, we would have uh, eight variants. The, we would have total number eight variants, how we can choose uh, three people. So let's list all these variants. For example, we can choose that all three would be girls so a girl a girl and a girl you also can choose two girls and one boy a girl a girl and a boy but we also can have another combination a girl a boy and a girl and a boy a girl and a girl we also may have two boys and one girl so boy boy and girl boy girl boy and a girl a boy and a boy and the last combination would be all three would be boys boy boy and the boy so let's count one two three four five six seven eight combinations as I predict earlier so now the most important part we have to find probabilities of each combination if you would think that probability of each combination would be 1 8 it is not true so take a look because we have different number of boys and girls so we also would have different probability to choose uh, a girl or a boy each time but out of all these combinations, we only were interested in those combinations that include one girl and two boys. And we see, for example, this combination here, this combination here, and this combination here that have two boys and one girl. So three out of eight. And now let's find what is the probability for each combination so for example for to choose uh, this boy what would be probability probability would be uh, we have 15 boys and 10 girls so we are choosing from 25 people and probability to choose the boy the first boy would be um, 15 we have 15 boys out of 25 people people what would be probability to choose second boy and as you remember we already choose one boy so now we have left 24 people so we are choosing from 24 people and we already choose one boy so only 14 left so we are choosing 14 our probability would be to choose a second boy 14 out of 24 and what would be probability to choose a girl 
and to choose a girl would be probability now we're choosing from 23 people and we choose from 10 girls so 10 over 23 and now we have to multiply all these probabilities and we are going to, we are going to get uh, 2100 divided by uh, 13,800. Now let's check uh, what is uh, going to be probability of this combination. Right away I can tell you probability would be the same, but let's do again a math. So to choose the first boy, would probability would be 15 out of 25. To choose a girl would be uh, this time 10 out of 24. And to choose a boy again would be, uh, we already choose one boy, so it would be, we are choosing from uh, uh, 23 people. And we suppose that we have 14 boys left. So this is going to be the same number, uh, 2100 over 13,800. And again uh, this is our calculations and the last time we also would get the same number but i still want to show you so uh, we choose the girl first so we are choosing out of uh, 25 people and we have 10 girls to choose uh, from so this is going to be our probability that uh, we choose this girl so out of 25 people, 15 boys and 10 girls, we're choosing the first girl and probability would be 10 out of 25. And to choose second boy, uh, we would have probability. Now we have 24 people left and uh, we have 15 boys. So probability would be 15 boys out of uh, 24 and the last probability to choose a boy uh, we have 14 boys left and uh, total number of people 23 so again we are going to get the same number 2100 over 13800 and now what we need to do we just need to add all these probabilities that we got here so what we are going to get uh, we are going to get 2100 plus 2100 plus 2100 over 13800 and we are going to get 6300 over 13000 800 and right away we can reduce this number by 100 so we are going to get 63 over 138 and we can reduce this number uh, we can reduce this number by 3 and our final answer would be 21 over 40 six and as you see this is answer a and this is all for today thank you for your attention please subscribe for my new videos that i post almost every day thumbs up if you like this video please write your comments questions if you have any share this video with your classmates and see you in the next video goodbye